Alright, let's get it. Part part nine of Final Fantasy VII Remake. Let's see, we got some side quests that we can do. Uh, where was I going? Stuck on people. Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. All right, crowd, oh, baby. You will? Oh man, you're the best. I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Be careful, they look dangerous. I'm glad I moved here, but. Nice sword you got. Hold on a second. All right, I'm back. I see you in chat, Jaheem. That sure was some wall markets making. All clear down We're patrolling for monsters. Huh? Get your slum meatballs right here. Slum meatballs. Yeah, I knew we were coming back to this spot. Five pieces I got in Shinra equipment. Don't you mean we've got this? Enough. Ha! And we're safe. 
Get back. I can fight too, you know. That's it. Oh, it's off you. It's over. Do it. I'll show you what I can do. Okay. Kinda of hurt. Uh... Bring it. This fight, I don't feel like dying. that ice out real quick. Come on. I'm with you. Let's go. It's on you. I'm coming. Oh, 
I'm not even about to do that. Come on, baby. Oh my gosh, look at this, bro. Stun locking me. I'm not even about to play this quest, bro. I'm about to go right back. Nope. Nope. Bring it. Seriously. Work. We out of here, bro. I got time for that. Uh. Made with homegrown spices. Some heavy duty of we get the occasional model. But seeing as maybe I'll go check to see. This place takes getting used. <sighs> so, do you think this means in my very first ever city night out? That form. Yes, ladies, do you mind taking I it? made it for sure. That's what's called easy money. We even got to be on TV. My face like that. Oh, you're that former soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? <sighs> that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. done with the flowers lovely don't you think great job that's wonderful <sighs> isn't it oh I nearly forgot I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago he was dressed all in black a little scary looking I look through the area for the kids. Oh, Cloud? Hey there. How goes the? 
the patrol. There's a lot more people on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! Did you know? This place is haunted. How many kids am I looking for? You scared me. Ew. Hey there. How goes the patrol? I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Ugh. But that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. Furthermore, initial reports confirm that terrorists were coordinating their efforts with Wu Tai. They crossed the line following the reaction. I wish I knew not to run this there how goes the patrol great I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions plus I helped an old lady cross the street you the busy. street is no cars it's what? a normal day for me gotta work hard the house depends on people's donations oh no I'm late did you see miss folia is she mad oh I gotta go I'm sorry Hello, Cloud. Sir, it's a real honor to meet you. I think you soldier guys are awesome. I want to be strong and tough when I grow up, too. You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are gonna have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot! I have to get back right now! Get your hands on the hottest It's like one more. Which way have I not gone? Really me? Don't give up! No. I can't believe I forgot all about the lesson. I really must. Which way have I not gone? I don't think I went through the middle. you should be worrying about right now? I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! That's everyone. Let's Bro. go back to the house. Look at this dog over here getting spoiled. Why his legs like that, though? His back legs. I thought we put those days of war and death behind us. But The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. 
You guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money! The watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout. And that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us! Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. The Toad King wants to take over our hideout. He's mean and angry and smells bad too, so be careful. I think I know what it is. I think. Always play when you come out here. Bro, what is that? Is that two monkeys? That shoulders tapping. Yeah, I knew they were adding jigsaw, but I didn't know they was adding Leatherface too. This isn't good. Here we go. That's that. <sighs> Moving on then. Leave this to me. I don't think so. <laughs> Let's do this. <sighs> Get ready. Get up. It's over. See ya. That wasn't so bad. Look at these things, bro. There you go over there. Look at him. Come on. I'm with you. Let's go. <laughs> Stay back. <laughs> Get him. Cut. <laughs> what 
they doing right now? Oh, 
Why are they so hard for no reason? Here it comes. Thank you. You need to heal. Just a little should help. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the King and his smelly friends. Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. A real family, in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. What kind of dream she's chasing tonight? No idea. Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. If you learn your ABCs, you can read any book. If you learn your ABCs, you can read any book. I got a nail bag. What is that? Yo.
That's cool. I forgot I even bought that for it. Before we go up there, we need to get her some. You're looking pretty good. Something real quick. I don't even know what spirit does in this game. Magic power. Oh, I think I think uh, spirit is like the amount of magic we have. She has good amount, so I'm gonna get her. I'm just increase her power. Got what you need to stay so safe. Boring. Coming. It's coming. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? Uh. He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Ugh. Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. <laughs> Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. 
Alright. You gonna fight me with his hands? This dude is G. Don't Hold take up. It personal. Woo! Okay. <laughs> you Turks are all the same. All bark. No bite. You're one to say that nigga cold. <laughs> Here we go. No need to get rough. You know that. Oh, sheep. Oh, oh. Ah, okay. Okay. Got some too. Oh, shoot. This nigga is cold. Try this. <laughs> oh. ah. Gotta get a little payback for my partner. Come on, man. Uh, give me that real quick. I'll take care of you. Run and tackle. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so uh, <laughs> talk to me like that. Oh, he's chasing me. Oh. I'm tripping. That's good, right? Yo, <laughs> he like suplex through me. <laughs> oh, this nigga crazy. Second win. <laughs> Trying to hit me with haymakers, bro. Like, chill. <laughs> he ain't like that, huh? No holding back. Come on. What's up? Oh! Damn! That move is like unblockable. Alright. You're done. What's up? Okay. <laughs> so you had enough yet? No, I don't believe that I have. Like Full new sunglasses out? Oh snap! Oh! Yeah. Ah. Yo, he ain't done yet. Yeah. Yo. Yeah. Ah. Oh snap! Yeah. This new cop. Yo. I see you. Oh, snap, huh? Oh, my gosh. How's this dude ain't playing. Be oh. Go on. Better You're going down. <laughs> I thought that what? I thought you would want to get rough. No, but this is self-defense. <laughs> How do I dodge that? Going all out. Look at him, bro. See how he got back up? Oh my gosh, this dude's cold. Any last words? Shit. <laughs> Enjoy the ride. Oh, I, I ain't dodged quick enough. Keep hitting him with that arrow. Done with. <laughs> oh, 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 ah! Okay. Okay. Hit him with it. Please, just leave us alone. Oh my god. You know I can't do that. You want some more?
there, partner. Huh? I'm but, sure uh, you're having the time of your huh? life, but we're needed on standby uh, for a job. It's something uh, about Sector 7. But, so get your ass back here now. But, I sound like that. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? Yo, what did I just witness? They gotta be my favorite bosses in this game, bro. You're heading in already? Yeah, I'm going in. Actually, no, 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 not quite yet. Actually, what was that game they were talking about? I'm not doing the other quest. I think it's too annoying. How some of the basic enemies be harder than boss fights, bro? It don't, it don't make sense. Now that things are starting to settle down a bit, we can finally play Whack-A-Box again. It's all thanks to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's this tired-looking guy out by the community center, and I heard he was looking for some help. Oh, hey, Cloud. You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack-A-Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're gonna make a special exception just for you. Yo, watch this dude. I'm missing this boss with them. 
Almost got the max. Wow, Cloud! I've never seen anyone do that before! See? Pretty fun, right? Play with us again, okay? It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. What do you think? You having fun yet? Heaps. Then you can't be afraid to show it more. Don't forget, it's all about service and salesmanship. I'll leave that to you. All right, but don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good. Cause I command a very good salary. Stop moving. Happen to be What's a up, certain bro? merc that's become the talk of the town. Yep. I'm Damon. Little more than a humble reporter with the daily buzz. Ah, uh, that rag? The one that's always printing awful rumors about the slums? On the contrary, my dear. We strive to raise awareness of the plight of our undercity brethren. We seek a better future for everyone, rich and poor. Now then, my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums? She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before divesting them of their valuables. Everyone knows her. Everything she steals, she gives to the poor and needy. Yes, she's got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here as a result. Nevertheless, she is a criminal and a threat to the public order. I've made it my mission to unmask the villain. But the locals have been uncooperative and uncommunicative, to put it mildly. And now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. Which brings me to you. The work of the hour, and the man who will serve up my scoop. Oh, 
guess that? The guardian angel of the slums? Come to think of it, a reporter came sniffing around asking about her. You his man? Huh. Even if I knew something, I wouldn't tell you. To folks around here, the angel is a hero. I ain't selling her out to Shinra. I love talking to these guys. Good to see you again, Murray. Good to see you too, Aerith. I'd heard you found yourself a funny new friend. Cloud? Meet Mireille. She knows everything there is to know about the slums. Mireille, meet Cloud. He's a former soldier and super strong. Mm, he looks useful enough. The kids have been talking about you. The defender of the secret hideout. And now the hero of the Leaf House is helping the Daily Buzz look for the angel of the slums. I am? <laughs> I'm a lover of the whispered word. Not that it's any real secret, considering how chatty the Chinra Mutt's been. Not looking into it for the reporter. I'm doing it for myself. Call it curiosity or whatever. Or could it be you've fallen under the angel's spell like so many others? Anyway, it so happens that I have some information for you. But I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Why don't you wait with that reporter of yours? You could see the sky? Try taking <laughs> Pressing the wrong button. I'm pushing on the stuff. Any news? Have you tried talking to Marae at all? She told us that she had some information to share. Marae? As in the Marae? The town gossip? I chased her for days begging for info, but she wouldn't give up a single scrap. So how do you get the old bird to talk? This old bird had a change of heart, that's all. Then quickly, before you have another, tell us, what do you know about the notorious angel of the slums? Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that, but I do know where her hideout is. Her base of operations? Now that's a scoop! Where is it? Tell me! Deep in the scrap, at Lookout Point. Hardly anyone goes out there these days. It's the perfect place for a criminal to hold up. Lookout Point. Got it! I'll check it out right now. But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard. About a terrible fiend that's claimed the Angel's hideout as its lair. Oh! Quite large. Lots of teeth. Always hungry. I don't know about you, but I'd not go anywhere near that thing. Oh, well, uh... <clears throat> well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. Uh, plan first, then act. That's every respectable journalist motto. If it's a plan you're looking for, I'd say you have one right here. Wouldn't you? So, my good mercenary, if I might impose upon you again, it would be lovely if you investigated Lookout Point for me. Out, bro. I've heard about you.
I'm running straight to the mission. I don't care who's gonna try to stop me. This is four. How you get in there? You're dead. This way, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Going in. Sorry, but we're in a rush. Gotta get through this. This one's for you. Bring it. Get him. One more shot. I'm waiting. Enjoy the ride. Hey, he's not even alive. That'll do. Bring it. Gonna get windy. This one's for you. You asked for it. Steady. Mind backing off a bit. I think we're almost done. 
It's my turn. One more shot. No way. How's he hitting that without getting knocked back? But I'll do. All right. You'll be blown away. <laughs> One more shot. That'll do. Well, that was I'm feeling pretty weak. Taken over. Not braver, focus stars. Let's die. What wait, seriously? You'll feel better in a second. <clears throat> I knew we would come back here at some point. The guardian angel of the slums will collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell him what we found.
you found one of her calling cards. This is the genuine article, I'm sure of it, pinned by the angel herself. Hmm. So this is one of her famous warnings. It's an incredible find. Oh, was that all? Hold on. Looks like there's something else. A message. To the nosy Shinra reporter sniffing around, I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget. However, by the grace of your mercenary friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time he might not be around to save you. You would be wise to watch your step. Not just a message from the angel. A warning. <sighs> if the merc here hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. <sighs> Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. <laughs> no harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip up Don Corneo! It's about damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark! I can't wait to see how this goes down! Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Okay. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's pocket. <laughs> Can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. I wish I could... Hi. You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry. It's not even late. What are you we talking about? We got a little about? sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask. But would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Uh. Can't sleep anyways. I've never been so proud. The man you've become. Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow. And tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. <sighs> Cloud don't never sleep with a blanket, bro. Don't want to overstay my welcome.
What are you First doing? step I took, bruh. Uh -huh. I couldn't even uh -huh. see that. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry. You'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. Please don't let her hear me again. Okay. That was a troll, bro. Look. This is so hard. Okay. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Wow. I bought her air rags. You treat me like this. It's like, nah. <laughs> Take a carrot or something. All right, back to the resistance, I guess. This place got a whole different vibe when it's night. Oh, uh, this ain't right. Something about to happen. Ain't nobody in the town at all. I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. How? Nothing. My eyes change. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but. That's the underside of Sector 6, Wall Market, a real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you. I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. 
Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. And now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Sound like Chicago. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. Gave me a bunch of potions. Happy music gone. It's been like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. I ain't seen one of these in a minute. Week two, I think it was fire. No escape. And we're safe. What's that? A big arm. Kind of cute, don't you think? Uh. I'm trying to hide stuff from me. up the ladder I wonder if we can use this
It's this way. Here's an idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. Really, Cloud? Like, I feel like Cloud could just jump up there, bro. You did it. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Hmm. All right. Good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. Stop. Did we wake it up? Yeah. <laughs> To trash. I wonder if someone blocked it off because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment. Back. We can fight too, you know. Stay back. You're done. Go on. Good night. Here it comes. I'm waiting. Cut. Cut. Sloppy. Oh my 
gosh. Hey, I bet you can grab that container with the arm. Not half bad. So do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? Yeah? Huh? Uh... <sighs> <sighs> oh no, look. Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. Okay, Cloud! Ready! Yeah, uh... They want me to put it. Wait, 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 wait. I see, I see. Hold on a second.
binding. Gotcha. Are you almost out of here? Whoa, not too fast, okay? Got it. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Hmm. Nah. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides, looky here, boys. Caught us some burglars. Some yeah, look at dude on the right. Stealing our shit, doing crimes. <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages. <laughs> Government uh, composite. I don't get it. Ah, how stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation. For damages! Oh yeah! <laughs> That's what you get when you... Oh, when somebody else... We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. Uh. Okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> due recompense. Due recompense. Due... due recompense. No shit for brains. Due recompense. It's like uh, uh -huh. it's like uh, uh -huh. compensatory damages. Oh, of course. So damages I recompense. I get it. <laughs> Simple as that. I think we've heard enough. Go ahead and fight these skinheads real quick. All right. Try me. 340 gil was stolen from me. Can I fight yet? Back in it. think they was doing shit let's get the hell out of here the way 
you guys! Don't leave me! I'm coming! Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Oh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. This be kind of heat. That road huh? cup. What we got here? Fresh meat to the sun. No holding back. Come on, hit me. Gotta get hit. Not stand the joints. I think I saw a control panel up above. Hmm. 
I think I saw a control panel up above. So how do I get up there? I think I saw a control panel up above. I heard you. I think I saw a control panel up above. Stupid ladders, always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm, got it? I placed the box. Could I just not place the box or something? Gotcha.
goodness. It's this way. down for you in a sec. Pretty well. Sure did. <laughs> uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just? Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> All right. Can we get out these dirty? Hold things? it right. Right. You want to pass through our territory? It's over. Then you better pay the toll. I see you. We made it. Smell the fresh air. Well, why is she running so fast? Gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for... Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on. time ago I used to sell flowers here oh yeah <sighs> so cloud you were a soldier first class right yeah Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him.
you okay? Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. Won't take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. getting home and if I said I wasn't I'll go with you I thought you needed to get back <laughs> don't worry I have a backup route for emergencies and it's safer too why didn't we all right <laughs> guess this is it then ready yeah. The heck is going What's on? Going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> I think Tifa is the uh the thief. Come on. Okay. Cause you remember they was talking about at the uh other joint. Come <laughs> Join on, right Cloud. back. We gotta hurry. Dang, chill. But anyway, I'ma end this part right here. Uh, I felt like I got a lot done. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, till next time, uh, we continue to go see where Tifa is. And, uh, yeah. I wonder how long I've been recording this. It must have been like two hours, I felt. Felt like two hours. But, uh, yeah. This is it for this part. Like, share, subscribe if you made it this far. And, uh,. See you guys in the next one. Peace.